Hello and welcome to the Scavel channel. Today, let's talk about the top 5 gaming mice you can buy in 2017 for your money. To make this the best list of gaming mice possible to determine what mice will be best for you in a certain price range, I've enlisted the help from another fellow tech huber to bring to you guys the best gaming mice list possible. What's up everybody, it's John from Awe of Tech alongside the legend Scatter Vault. So let's take this top gaming mouse video to the next level already. With such diversity in gamers preferred mouse features, buttons, size, shape, weight, and the vast nuance beyond, I think it's a great fit to approach this top five gaming mouse video in collaboration style presenting you a unique assortment of mice that's sure to cater to a large range of gamers and their favorite gaming genres. So let's start this video off already, kicking it back over to Scattervolt with a number five pick in this gaming mouse lineup. First up, we have the Corsair Glaive for $70. Now you may be asking, why does I have to start off with a $70 gaming mouse for this list? Well, I personally think that the Glaive is a tremendous mouse, especially for its FPS gaming capabilities, which is why it lands a spot on this list for the best gaming mice for 2017. My only issue with it is the build quality you're getting for the price. I feel like for $70, you can get a better built mouse, maybe with some stronger materials on it than a Death Adder-esque feeling mouse dense with a lot of plastic. But don't get me wrong, it's a tremendous gaming mouse. It's got the Pixar 3367 sensor, one of the latest and greatest optical sensors you can get, and this mouse will virtually be able to fit on any hand with its switchable thumb grips. Plus, I feel like this is a like one of the first gaming mice that Corsair's actually finally managed to nail down in terms of looks, because it looks awesome. Anyways, now to the number four mouse. Okay, okay, so no doubt the Corsair Glaive is a pretty awesome mouse. This next mouse is for all of you who really enjoy utilizing those side buttons. This one specifically designed for MOBA gaming, so much so that it's garnered a reputation being called the OP MOBA gaming mouse. Meet the Razer Naga Hex V2, 14 programmable buttons in total, and a mechanical thumb wheel with seven buttons that are equidistant from that thumb wheel. So it's really nice to develop muscle memory to those seven buttons. They're also very tactile, great feedback, and certainly ready for the fast twitch demands of today's gaming competition. The ergonomics of this mouse are quite exceptional. Really awesome for palm grip and medium sized hand. And left and right click have that familiar fast actuation crispiness that's known of Razer. Has a tilt click scroll wheel. And among all these exceptional features, the mouse has awesome glide, really large feet on the bottom that enhance those swift, precise movements. So all in all, I think that the custom modern design of the Razer Naga Hex V2 and the implementation of all the features within done so masterfully definitely solidifies the Razer Naga Hex V2 as the number four spot in this epic gaming mouse lineup. Well, back to you, Scattervolt, with the number three pick. Anyways, thanks to Optech for that segment on the Razer Naga, and to follow up on that, for number three, I have chosen the Cougar Revenger Optical Gaming Mouse for $45. Now, I mainly love this mouse because it has some of the best ergonomics I've ever felt and used. It's got such a great shape to it that it's almost like my deadly driver, the Corsair Saber. I could use it all day. More or less though, in addition to its understated stylish looks, which I really admire, its game performance is just at what you expect. Combined with its great ergonomics and a separate mouse pad, this mouse is unbeatable. It can go up to 12,000 DPI with its Pixar 3360 optical sensor and it's guaranteed to step up your game if you're looking to upgrade your current gaming mouse. I for one explicitly remember getting some of the best KDAs ever with the Cooper Revenger while I was testing it out on CSGO versus some other mice I compared it to at the time like the Corsair M65 Pro, the Cooper 450M, and even the Gigabyte MX780. Alright everyone, up next from Logitech, this is certainly a candidate for the ultimate gaming mouse. If any mouse was ever said to be overkill, well, the Logitech G900 Chaos Spectrum is certainly the number one candidate. This mouse really does it all. First off, it has among the best, a near flawless optical sensor that really gives a one-to-one -one feel, truly an extension of yourself. Also, it has a magnificent ambidextrous design, sporting 11 programmable buttons and modularity to the side buttons on either side. So you can decide whether you want them, don't want them, what side you want them on. And of course, it has that Logitech famous freeform scroll wheel that's so fun 
to scroll through pages with. All the buttons on this mouse are so satisfying to press left and right click in particular with a mechanical pivot design that just gives an incredible amount of consistency, reliability, and awesome tactile feedback. And if all this awesomeness were not enough, the G900 is wireless. So this is the mouse along with the Logitech Prodigy G403 that really redefined the landscape, really changed a lot of people's opinions on whether wireless can compete with wired in terms of competitive gaming. This one, its input latency is on par with the click latency, sensor latency of the top of the line gaming mice from its competitors. Even at times, superior input latency from wireless to wired. They truly did it. Wireless capabilities are exceptional on the Logitech G900 and it's ready for the competitive arena of gaming. So all in all, the Logitech G900 really shines, excels in every category, really putting it among the best gaming mice to buy for 2017. We'll back over to you Scattervolt with the number one pick for this epic gaming mouse video. So for the number one gaming mouse on this list, and it's quite the shocker, I've chosen the Corsair Harpoon for $30. You guys who've been fan of the channel know I adore this mouse since the day I got her to review it. Like all tech said, I wholeheartedly agree that the Logitech G900 is the ultimate gaming mouse you can buy. It is the best of the best. However, the reason why it isn't the number one mouse on this list is that it costs $120, whereas the Harpoon is only 30. The Harpoon is severely underrated and it can still game in intense situations where accuracy matters the most. It's just that its value is unbeatable. Its lightweight frame and accurate sensor has allowed me to land some pretty nasty shots in counter strike Global Offensive and Planet Side 2 and other FPS titles. I mean, you'd be surprised for $30, the Corsair Harpoon boasts an optical sensor that can go up to 6,000 DPI, offers RGB lighting, a solid build quality, which is to be expected from a Corsair mouse, and it's all backed by Corsair's famous Q2 peripheral software. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I want to give a huge shout out to the guy who made this video possible, John from Awe of Tech. He runs another tech YouTube channel, which is a smaller channel than mine, but he does just as cool things. He's doing a lot of upcoming testing with the Ryzen 3 processor. So be sure to head over to his channel. He's got a lot of really cool things in the works. And if it weren't for him, then this video for the top five gaming mice would have not have been possible. So I want to give a huge thanks to him and a link to his channel will be in the description down below. Anyways, like always, be sure to like, favorite, subscribe, and all that. And this is the Scavel TV channel. Signing out.